Are you guys ready for the next time coming to the stage, everybody? All right. Up next, we got a, a duo. We got a duo coming up here. This is you all, you all. You all are in for a special treat. We got the Maraca Brothers, everybody. One more time, the Keep it up, for the Maraca Brothers, everybody. Yeah. We're the Morocco Brothers. Uh, Thanks, Chase. It's been like eight months. Um, we're uh, we're fraternal twins. Uh, my name is Sandra, and this is my brother Brian. Hey. Um, so we're gonna tell some jokes for you tonight, and uh, we hope you have a good time. Cause we had a good time writing them. So. Yeah. Um, oh, Sandra, how'd that uh, blind date I set you up on? Um, how'd that go? He set me up with the homeless guy who hangs outside a kangaroo. So I'm well? <laughs> well, when the bill came, the guy said that he left his wallet and his other pants. And when I asked him if he had other pants, he said no. <laughs> I'm beginning to think he never had a wallet to begin with. <laughs> Did you, did you at least get some action afterwards? When I dropped him off at his overpass, he told me that I was a sinner and I needed to repent. And then he sneezed in my face. <laughs> and the sneeze smelled like beer farts. So it went well. Compared to my last few days, yes. <laughs> well, you're welcome, Sandy. You're welcome. And. I hope you'll repay the favor by hooking up me with one of your hot acquaintances. I'm hoping you turn some of those hot acquaintances into hot friends, Brian. I am known to break a heart or two. That would be not good. Too soon, Brian. Telling Grandpa that Obama canceled Social Security and giving him a heart attack is not a laughing matter. <laughs> The funeral's like three hours ago. Three hours ago. God, Sandy, move on. dot com. I'm still having cocktail weenie burps from the after lunch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was that? It's a, it's a new thing I'm doing. I'm trying to connect with we, the audience. No, we didn't do that in rehearsal. <laughs> and David Arquette splitting up? What? <laughs> I know, it's sad. If they can't make it, who will? I just got used to calling her Courtney Cox Arquette. <laughs> Shouldn't you be happy though? You love her, right? You have, a, you have a Cougar Town promotional poster up in your room? I mean, I just want her to be happy. I, I can never fulfill her middle-aged sexual needs. <laughs> and wait, wait, David Arquette is single. Aren't you president of his fan club? You're thinking of David Spade. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm only sergeant at arms. Wait, who's president then? David Spade. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> Hey, wait. Oh. You notice anything new about me? Oh, uh, no, no. I shaved my balls last night. <laughs> I was gonna say that, uh, but I didn't want to embarrass myself in front of everyone and be wrong. No, I lied. I waxed my balls. You would have, you would have been wrong. So, so that's what the mess was in like in the garbage. I thought Mom just threw away the Shih Tzu clippings again. <laughs> Well, okay, my pubes are shockingly straight and long. Uh, it's like somebody glued John Stamos's head face first into my abdomen. It's weird, too, because I call my penis John Stamos because his favorite song is Kokomo. And he can dance. That's weird, because I call my vagina Mary Kate Olsen. <laughs> why, why not Ashley Olsen? Because Mary Kate's the sluttier one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, 
get the hobo tested for STDs before you did it? Of course. Well, do I look like an idiot? All right, you got me. You got me, sis. Uh, so, so how do you feel about mom and dad's divorce? That's sad, I guess. Dad told me you were the reason they got divorced. Well, I did introduce mom to Jim, so... <laughs> I liked him too, that's why I introduced him to mom. You know what the best part about the divorce is? <laughs> Two Christmases. Well, one Christmas and one Kwanzaa. <laughs> mom converted for Jim. One Christmas and one Kwanzaa! And I finally have a reason to wear my dashiki. <laughs> Now it's probably not the time to tell you, but it makes you look fat. Hey, fuck you, sis. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have been great. 